Today we're talking about, about um, getting church here because like, you know, as Christians we should, you know, the church should be the place where we go to for comfort and that's the place where we face the most criticism and um, yeah, so this is my poem called uh, To Whom It May Concern. Mm. To whom it may concern, I have pages for you to turn, I have scriptures you can abuse, I have souls for you to burn, secretly judging me because I'm different. But we two peas in a pod, thinking because you hide your sins, it makes you much more close to the guy than I could ever possibly get. Then I could even possibly know, you see, I wrote this poem so we could both spiritually grow and how you spiritually condemn my soul as if I was a spiritual lover. Mr. and Miss, I don't know what you've been told, but see, the Lord is also my shepherd, so to whom this may have set, we could sit here and debate why you utilize scriptures of love to introduce your views of hate, but contrary to your belief in what you think may be my fate, I know my soul is down for heaven. My relationship with God is great, because when I wake, I repent, I'm a sinner. And I know he sets me free. Now tell me, Mr. and Mrs., what makes you so different from me? Yes, to whom this may displease, what makes you think you know my life? He said the Bible was your sword. He never said it was a knife that you can use to cut me down. Yeah, you do it like it's a sport. How quickly you forget that we've all sinned and fallen short. This poem's for those who judge like courts. I'm not asking you to love me. I'm asking you to realize that only God can judge me. It's gonna get ugly because this poem's for people who spit scriptures out of spite. You're precisely the kind of people that weaken the body of Christ. Here's some advice. Just because your tongue never breaks an ounce of liquor, don't think even for a second it somehow sends you to heaven quicker. Don't think that because these hands were once so quick to fight that I can put them both together and use them to pray at night. I walk by faith and not by sight. Yeah, maybe not as fast as you, but these lips once took bong hits and now they currently the truth and these feet used to run the trouble and now they're currently being used to stand up for people like me who are sick and tired of being spiritually abused by people like you who use the word of God to speak death and why because certain verses condemn me and the other ones don't apply that just ain't right mm. using my past as a weapon so you can hurt me I know the ways of sin is death but see I also know of his mercy don't define people based on their past mm. you yourself have a past to be seen so before you start pointing fingers make sure your hands are clean yeah.